Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here with me. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It's much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Libra. Thank you Lord God for blessing, blessing this reading for Libra so that clarity, um, truth, accuracy, rest with Libra. All right. So let's see. So what we got here, we asked some, some really, uh, um, specific questions here. The first question, because I want to touch most bases with everybody because everybody's going through something different, but most people want to know, am I going to find someone new? Am I going to find new love? So that was the first question that I asked the cards. And um, we got the Knight of Swords. Uh, no, you're not gonna find new love. What you are going to find is someone um, coming to you quick, fast, in an in a hurry, um, confronting you, or wanting to talk to you, or or basically being very blunt. And letting you know where they stand and not mincing their words because they've become knowledgeable about something here. They have become aware. And this could be you, Libra. It could be the other person. It could be you. Um, someone has become very clear and they're using logic and, and not their intuition. They've analyzed the information. Um, and right now they're treating this situation very numerical they're really calculated or really calculating things in terms of this this uh conversation and this person so you have someone coming toward you confrontational they want to get their point across to you they're single-minded okay um because of the newfound knowledge that they have and what they could be telling you is that they want to expand expand on their own and go their own way they want to leave this connection behind um, right now, okay? And they also could be kind of laying down the law for you in terms of how things are going to go. Or this is you, Libra. I'm not exactly sure. But someone is definitely coming to you with some choice words, letting you know how they feel, what's going on. Um, it could be confrontational, okay? Um, but they've gotten some enlightenment. They communicated with the sibling, friends, family, somebody, and they got enlightenment about, um, how this relationship needs to go or grow. So it's like somebody's going to lay down law or, um, rules of engagement in terms of dealing with one another and in order to see progression, in order to see, um, stability in this connection. So when it's saying, this is, this is what we need to do. This is how it needs to go. Um, someone is just voicing their opinion about the newfound information that they have. They also could be saying, I want to go it alone. I don't want to be in this connection anymore. They're leaving something behind. They're leaving a partnership, the two ones behind. Okay. How your person is viewing you, Libra, whomever you're coming to the reading for, whomever this is about. Um, they're viewing you as the mature woman. Okay. Uh, poverty. So, bad health. See that. And journey. Okay. So they, they're viewing you as ha having got some inkling, some maybe even intuition. I don't know, but maybe got some knowledge about um, something and now you, you've come to a place of um, of harmony within yourself in terms of letting this person go or this relationship go letting something in you come to understand the fullness of its value is that it needs to end um, there's going to be devastation here or um, someone's not going to get what they want they're going to be left out in the cold so it's like something where your person feels like you you under you got knowledge of something, you got wind of something, 
And this also could be vice versa. Um, and now it's over, okay? Where this is the beginning of the end or the relationship is in bad health right now. Um, the, the foundation, the stability, the firm foundation, the roots that you guys had laid together is, um, is cracking. You know, the, the foundation is cracking here. It also could be about maybe sexual activity with other people. Um, somebody feels like Libra, you are leaving. Maybe you're going to leave them holding the bag. You're going to leave them to take the rap. You're going to leave them to, um, to go down for this. Libra, somebody feels like something arrived for you and now you're gone. You're, you're on your own journey. You're on your own path here. You're out. You're out the door. Um, you're done. Yeah, that's, I just keep hearing you're done. Um, yeah, you feel like no second chances here. It's this time to, to step forward um, and to leave this uh, familiar connection behind that maybe you want newness or this is what someone is saying to you or you saying to them you want newness you want to move on um someone could be trying to, to end the connection amicably you know like hey i'm leaving and you know i wish you well wish me well but this is over i can't do this anymore or i don't want to do this anymore the energy between the two of you is the child here so um all things new new relationship new pregnancy um new home um a new start um someone also again this come reducing to a nine someone could have some solo plans they're relying on themselves they're not focused on connection um they're relying on their own intuition their own um their own mindset um, their own personal philosophy here what makes sense to them so it's like somebody saying, you know, I, I know this, I found this out, or I think this way, or blah, 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 and I, this needs to be done, um, and I need to have my own start elsewhere by myself. Libra, how you view your person is calculated as a false person. As you, you, you view them as, um, this is premeditated. Like, you know, this is what, I don't know, they got information from a family member, a woman, or somebody, or something. Um, a psychic or in, uh, intuitive person, um, tarot card reader, somebody here gave them information or somebody got information somehow. You got information, Libra. And now how you view your person is the false person. You view them as masquerading around as if they are something that they're not. Um, you view them as having that mask up so you wouldn't see um, how faulty, how, you know, debased, how uh, disloyal, dishonest they are. Um, they thought behind this veil, behind this mask, behind the mask, they had a power, but they didn't. Um, you view them as, um, or this is how somebody's view you, Libra, I don't know. Um, yeah, you view them as just all things falsehood, a facade, fake. They don't know how to be real if real came up and bit them on the behind. Um, you view them as... Uh, materialistic a uh, carnal sexual based everything is you know uh they go off of their urges here <laughs> excuse me you view them as having another person i don't know you view them as um keeping secrets deceptive liar it says liar 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 that's how you view them Le uh libra the advice for you in terms of dealing with this connection is, which is really weird for me. Um, the advice is the, and it came out just like this, the Queen of Wands, the King of Wands, and the Eight of Pentacles. All right, so for some of you, you just need to be focused on your business. Some of you need to be focused on the business of this relationship, especially from August 23rd um, or August 28th to September 1st. Um, somewhere in that, you know, that time frame, um, you need to have drive and dedication to make your project, you know, damn near perfect. You need to be focused on work. Okay. Um, some of you are putting 
work over love, you're neglecting your home or your love. Some of you are working too hard to meet somebody new. And you need to stop it. Some of you understand that you've given this person chance after chance after chance over and over. Someone could be thinking of you over and over. Someone is trying in this relationship, just continuously trying, putting energy, effort into something. And it's it's not getting to a self-sustaining energy. It just it's just always work. It's always work. You know, one party could be more invested in the connection than the other. You need to pay attention to the details in terms of this connection, this relationship, Libra. Or someone is paying attention to the details. So you need to cover tracks if you if that is that. At the bottom of the deck, you have the three of pentacles in reverse. None of my cards should be reversed, but this one is. So some of you need to... If you're dividing your energy effort in terms of someone else, you need to stop. Also, this talks about the masculine, the feminine, and the divine spark that holds them two together. I think the both of you are, and you're not coming up in your masculine and your feminine energy. Both could be coming up very masculine or very feminine to where there's no yin and no, no yang. There's no balance here. So there is no working together. There is no progression. You both are not doing anything together also it's, you, you guys are coming up as very autonomous you know uh, i'll see you on the weekend okay the weekend comes we see each other we depart on sunday and then you know we'll see each other on the weekend again it you know it's very very separatist i don't know very very uh independent in nature there's no coming together there's no doing anything. It also says Libra, you might you might be putting energy effort into the wrong thing or the wrong person too, because the Three of Pentacles upright talks about energy, effort, talent being put to good use to the right thing or the right person. So um, that is um, that is what you need to be focused on here, or that's your uh, advice. The cards also, the soulmate cards want you to know that everything you've ever wanted is on the other side of fear. So you got to dispel fear from your life um, and stop making fear based decisions. Also, adventure awaits you. Go find it. Yeah. Adventure awaits you. Um, get out there and make life happen. You control the dynamic here, um, <clears throat> even in some connection. I don't know if you're giving somebody a chance over a chance to bring in money or to, to stand up and be the, the stand up person. Somebody could be living off of you. You could be the masculine one in their relationship. The other person can be the feminine one. Even if you are a woman, you could be coming up masculine and then your man is feminine. It could work for you. It could not work for you. I don't know. At times, I think you get frustrated with that. Um, you're waiting for something to turn over to, to return to you. Put something out. You're waiting for the return. You're waiting for the successful project to be uh, to be had for you to celebrate here. Um, you put a lot of energy into something or someone also, and you're waiting for you know you to be able to brag about it or be able to celebrate this energy that you've spent in this person or this relationship. This is what I got for you, Libra. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Libra. Many blessings to you. Take care.